This guy's new enemy is about to be crushed by Nautils! These guys make me so proud. Hey everyone, I wanted to put this disclaimer at the beginning of the video so that way no one is confused by the different video styles. Anyways, this first part of the video you're about to watch is a review of the previous snapshot 20W51A, made by LLNK Edward MMOs. However, the second part of the video for 21W3A was recorded by myself and Edward with a special guest, whom I will keep secret till that segment, of course. Also, yes, I'm still on my YouTube break as of the time I record this video, but I didn't want to delay the snapshot review any longer. Here you are. Here is the snapshot video for both 20W51A and 21W.3A. Sorry, my brain died for a second. Anyways, enough disclaimers. Enjoy the video. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Minecraft snapshot review. It is a link Edward MMO is hosting this one. Anyways, today we're looking at 20W51A and this one is a monumental for those who like axolotls because they have been added into the game as of this snapshot. They're pretty cute and they spawn in like five different colors. Yellow, white, pink, brown, and the rare variation is blue. And as you can see, they like to eat fish. And they murdered a bunch of fish over here. <laughs> they do not spawn naturally, though, as of yet. Maybe they will in the next snapshot, but for now, let's take a look at what features they can do. So as you can see, they can be put in a bucket like other fish can. And when they are bucketed, they can actually fight by your side. And they can be bred with tropical fish. And they are passive towards players, of course. Alright, let's get let's get a few over here. What's that guy trying to do? Uh, I help him. Okay. Yeah, they make babies when fed with tropical fish. And of course the buckets of tropical fish can do the same thing, but of course, they're pretty much the same entity. They may play dead when damaged, receiving regener regeneration 1 on them. Not sure if I can get these guys to do it though. They attack drowns, guardian squid and fish so if i send it from zombie yeah you can see they're attacking him but if i summon another one and not tempt any any one of the axolotls with a tropical fish they won't attack it but of course the drowned is going after him so yeah I think the guardians might do the same thing. Oh yeah, they do. <laughs> oh, as you can see, that one's playing dead. <laughs> oh my god. That is one of the funniest things I've seen. But yeah, get over here and fight this thing, would ya? <laughs> They are the cutest little predators in the game. But now we move on to the changes that have been made. So the Skulk Sensor, you may remember that from the previous snapshot, right? 20W49A. These have been changed as well. Walking on wool no longer causes vibrations. Eating star has been removed as an event. Throwing wool as an item on the ground no longer causes vibrations either. And then skulk sensors are now silent while waterlogged. As you can see the axolotls are going past the skulk sensors, but they're not making any sounds under the water. Bundles! When 
destroyed as an entity, it drops the items that it currently has. Like so. And it has a changed interface. It has like so it shows two empty slots when not full, and an X when they're full. The first item in a bundle is now highlighted. Shulker boxes, they're like the bundles where they drop their items when destroyed as entities. So pretty interesting stuff I must say. The last few changes are the resource packs. Bundle icons are now a separate texture. And that's about it. I sadly never got the blue axolotl spawn variant. But uh, it shall be displayed when looking at the snapshot in the upcoming video. But uh, yeah. We now turn into Nathan for 21W.3A. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the world of tomorrow! Yes, that is right. We are now in 2021 um, as of recording this part of the video for the snapshot review. 21W3A, and we're also joined by our special guest, DJ Char. So, uh, hello, Char. How are you today? <laughs> Nathan's Good. special girlfriend. <laughs> HEY! I'll reveal that when I can. Anyway, so... <laughs> anyway, so... We are now in 21w.3a, which has the addition of the glow squids. So, as you can see by this fish tank here, we got ourselves the glow squids in all of their glory. So, the glow squids first appeared in... The Minecraft Earth. Minecraft Earth, and they were also voted as a new mob during Minecraft Live, yeah, so... And this was the mob that was somewhat controversial, since apparently it's apparently useless. However, if you do kill these glow squids, you're able to get this, which is a the glow ink, ink stack. stack, which can be used to basically put on signs, so that way they can glow. And they can also be used to craft the glow item frame, which is another new item. Yep, so what it takes is a glow ink sack of your choice, and an item frame in order to get the glowing item frame, as and shown as here. As you can see in this comparison... Yep, we have a netherite sword in the regular item frame, and in the new item frame, um, it's... It's a lot different than previously, so, yeah. Another new crafting recipe that was added. Pointed dripstone can, dripstone can be used to craft the dripstone block. Yeah, four pointed dripstone in order to create the block of dripstone. <laughs> and the next thing we have is glow lichen, which, which can be found rarely in caves. Yep. Uh, these are pretty much going to be the new light sources um, in caves, which honestly is much better than carrying around torches. Plus, if you let They're me naturally generated. Yep, and they are actually naturally da generated as well. I just spelled bone. They can be harvested with shears. Yep. Uh, let me go and grab myself some shears. 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 I, I can't spell shear correctly. So, uh, she she. There we go. Right. Screw it. Oh, you're demonstrating that. Um. Oh yeah, like so. Also. With these glow chins, you can actually put some bone meal on it, and they can actually grow like so. So, yeah. Also, um, before we end off this uh, snapshot video, let us actually release the axolotls onto the glow squids, so that way both of them can have their little mini civil war as such. So, anyways, without further ado, release the axolotls! Here they go, so axolotls in this update can attack glow squids at will. So, yeah. Yeah. And that massive army of axolotls is swarming in on all of them. Yep, and they could also, axolotls do attack fish, as shown in the previous video. Uh, which and other and normal squids. Yep, they also attack normal squids as well. But yeah, I think that's pretty much. All there is for 21w.3a. Um, There's also the fact that you can... Hold up. 
You can use a normal ink sack to remove the glow effect. Oh, okay, now it works. Now I can see what. Okay, let me. Okay, now I can kind of see the difference. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on. So let me remove it quick. Re-add it back. Okay, so yeah, now I can see the glow effect for some reason. So apparently the text is brighter if you uh if you have the ink sack the glowing ink sack on, but if removed, it turns to returns to normal. Oh, and um, there's also th this uh, new death message that we should probably show. Yeah, good idea. Um, there is a new death new death message, like as shown here. Edward uh, Brony MC was impaled by a stalagmite. But yeah, I think that's pretty much it for both snapshot videos. If you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more snapshot videos in the not too distant future, then be sure to hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel and want to see more, then do subscribe as well. Hit that little bell to be notified when new videos drop. Uh, thank you to uh, DJ Char and Elevank Edward MMOs for joining me in this video. And yeah. We will see you guys next. Anyways. Next anyways, that is all from me and Char and uh, Edward. Thank you guys so much for watching. And of course, we will see you guys in the next Snapshot video. Goodbye. Oh crap, I just realized I have to take a whiz. Um. Be right back, I'll be- <laughs> Hang on, I gotta- I gotta go take a whiz quick. Give me a sec, I'll be right back. Oh. <laughs> I see what you're doing. <laughs> Alright, I'm back officially this time round, and look my- at what, Look at what Char did. Hang on, I'm trying to get my keyboard back into place. Give me a second. There we go. All right, what did she do? What the f No! You kidding me? And no! Sign. What? I can't read this. Um, what? Nath worth twenty pounds? Are you kidding me? God no! <laughs> really, Char? And really? Like, oh my god! <laughs>